Welcome to a Friday fireside chat. I was not planning on doing this, but literally the day that uh, we're recording these, we're being uh, Nate and myself. I had a couple of these just social media things pop up, and the one actually was somebody writing me through the website through our live chat, and I, I couldn't resist not only from a kind of an entertainment value, but just truly from an educational value because trading is so mental and I, I, I get it. These ex situations are on a, a very far end of the spectrum. But as I always say, and I'm gonna continue to say, if things can go this far to crazy, which I don't know any other word for it, that far to crazy, where are other the areas where the human mind could be taking you? Heck, could be taking me. That's why I'm always trying my best to be so self-aware because as I've been in, you know, doing what I've been doing with the clay trader business, I've seen a lot of stuff. And just when I think something can't get any dumber, any crazier, I see this. And before I go any further, I do want to note that I'm not sitting here, uh, you know, going through this with some sort of entitled, I've always had it figured out attitude. I was like king dumb, king stupid. When I first got started, I thought I was going to get rich on a penny stock that did stainless steel mufflers. I brought that up before, but just, if this is your first video, I, I am not somebody that thinks that, you know, well, I've always had it figured out and these people, I don't, you know. No, I, I, I've been there and, I mean, I highly doubt these people watch this, but if they do, then it's time to wake up. It's time to use some common sense. It's time to realize what your mind is doing to you. And what your mind is doing to you is, it is blaming all sorts of external forces for something that is your fault. You pulled the trigger, you entered into the trade. And the trade, as you saw by the title of this video, HMNY. And unless you live under a rock or in a cave, you know that HMNY has been in the headlines quite a bit. And I would say that's probably the most historic, if not uh, you know, very close to the most historic stock I've ever seen in the sense of the price getting beat down from dollars to pennies. Then they reverse split and the reverse split price was 25 and then literally it went from 25 to now where it is at the time of this revort video, below 10 cents in like two and a half weeks. To 25 to below 10 in 10 cents in like two weeks. It's insane. And then you read about the company, oh, they gotta get loans, oh, they're shutting down the service because they, they're out of money, okay, they got the loan, but they gotta pay back the loan, and I mean, so the company's just dumping shares to raise, I mean, it is a train wreck. In other words, there are millions upon millions upon millions of dollars that are being traded in this thing. So a lot of people are trading it. There is a whole lot of dollar volume. And then I got this today that came through the website. Your inner circle talked strategy in regards to HMNY breaches several rules mandated by the SEC regulatory body. With confirmed timestamped messages of users in your board committing collusion with the aim to distort share price. I wanted to make your opinion on making these conversations public. Surely your services does not stand for these kind of operations, or do they? I'm not making this up. Literally, somebody is saying that the inner circle, which if you're not aware, that's just the private trading group that I have. It costs $99 per year. So, so as I told this person, and I'll tell anybody, if you think that the group is manipulating, you will be a superhero amongst the tinfoil hat community. Pay the $99, come on in, and I'm giving you permission. Snap screenshots, take screenshots of all this collusion that is supposedly taking place, and then you may, I'm giving you permission. I will not sue you for posting these screenshots publicly of the collusion that is supposedly taking place. That's all you gotta do. It's amazing how many articles and, and accusations have been written about all this, and then you're like, wow, why don't somebody just pay the $100 and get all the proof they want? They would be a superhero, but they, they never do that, which kinda is crazy. But again, the human mind, of course it's crazy, of course their logic doesn't make any sense, but it's the human mind that does not want to blame itself for the reason that clearly this person is losing a whole bunch in HMNY. So instead of looking in the mirror and saying, you know, I, I probably should have gotten out, I probably should have had a stop loss in, they are typing this message to me, your group is colluding, are you aware that it's against the SEC, and I'm gonna, you know, post, is it, you know, maybe this, maybe it's, me is there a possibility that it's bad business? That their business model just is not working? 
Did you have you been following the headlines? Have you seen all these you know emergency loans that they've had to secure? Is it is that a possibility that maybe all these loans they're needing to sell shares to finance? The word dilution is dilution maybe actually is that a possible or is it really some group on the internet that's colluding behind the scenes and this group you know costs ninety nine dollars a year to join? It's not like we're <laughs> it's. $10,000 a year because we are a hedge fund on Wall Street. No, well, according to some pe people would probably believe that. It's $99 a year. Sign up, get all the evidence you want. Mary Clay, this is, this is one person. And then like 10 minutes later, I saw this on a social media outlet. HMNY, F Clay, all I gotta say, dude manipulates with his charts, has enough viewers to manipulate, he knows it. Remember what I said about millions of dollars trading hands? I mean, all you gotta do, look at the volume that HMNY has been doing, especially at the time in this video. And I mean, it's millions upon millions of dollars. Do you really think that some guy, I mean, all you gotta do, look at, and I'm, I realize that for a lot of you, you get it, but I mean, common sense. And my point here is that the human mind, if you let it to get this crazy, literally kicks common sense to the curb because common sense would state, well, let me look at how many views a Clay Trader video actually gets. And let's just call it, let's go crazy, because my video charts don't get this amount of views, but let's just say the video chart for HMNY gets 10,000 views. So you're telling me that 10,000 views, 10,000 people that saw it was enough to manipulate how millions upon millions upon millions of dollars traded? Well, Clay, one of those people could have $20 million. If you think that somebody with $20 million is watching a random person on YouTube and then basing their, you know, their decisions off of that, like I said, you're kicking common sense to the curb. Your ego, in the sense of you wanna protect how you feel about yourself, is so out of whack that you are willing to blame anything and everything, no matter how illogical it actually is. I get it, if these were stocks that trade like 100 bucks a day, then yeah, you could say, Clay, you're manipulating that stock. Well, yeah, I mean, I could manipulate, I could buy $500 of it, and it would go skyrocketing if it only does $100 in liquidity. But the kicker is HMNY. It is a very, very fluid stock with all kinds of volume. And then to have these sorts of accusations, it's just people, you gotta, you gotta be aware. And this is nothing new, I talk about this all the time in my Clay Trader Mail segment, but I wanted to bring it over to the vlog just to really, like I said, hopefully add some entertainment value here. But to, to make you aware, if you're somebody that's new, be aware of what's going on in your mind. Your, your mind, due to the ego, the ego being how you feel about yourself, is very protective, especially when it comes to losing money. But you can never, you you will never succeed as a trader until you start to blame yourself. As long as you're blaming external forces, you will never succeed. You will never get better. Because think about that situation. Blaming external forces means, hey, there's nothing I can do. I'm just, there's nothing I can do. How how de that's such a depressing attitude. Whereas if you actually blame yourself, think about how great of a situation that is. Because guess what, if you're the problem, that means that you're the solution too, and you can fix the issue. So stop blaming everything else other than yourself. Stop putting yourself in such a depressing outlook on things, because you're never gonna be able to fix it if it's everybody other than you. But if it is you, then you can fix it. And I realize most people watching this probably do not believe any of this. Maybe you think, Clay, why do you even bother? I bother because the data keeps on piling in that there's enough people out there that I wanna at least offer out these warning videos to them. And if I can even affect one or two of them to kinda of get the light bulb to go on and say, you know, I've been believing some pretty crazy things in my mind in the, you know, the spirit of not wanting to blame myself, then that's awesome. That means this video was well worth it if I can get the light bulbs to come on for just even a few people that may happen to watch this. So, uh, but for those of you, hopefully you got some comedic value out of it, but yeah. And, and if you're wondering, HMNY, if, if you wanna know if we're colluding, if you think that we're colluding, then let, watch me turn this into a sales pitch. Pay the $99, you'll get 12 months access to snap all kinds of screenshots of all this supposed collusion going on, and then you can send it to the SEC, you can send it to CNBC, they'll probably do a big news story on it, that there's some little you know, uh, chat room in the butt crack of the internet that's manipulating all these stocks. You will be like a research hero because you'll have 12 months of time available to you to snap all these screenshots for only $99.
If you are out there trading alone currently and maybe are in the market looking for a community to join to assist you in your trading or to just help you, you know, give you another set of eyeballs, then I do have a private trading community where you can trade alongside me and other experienced traders. So what you see popping up on the screen right now is both an information link. So if you click on the inner circle one, that is going to take you to the page where I explain all the details of what exactly come with the community, both the chat room and the newsletter. And then the other image that has popped up is a behind the scenes tour where you can see exactly what is going to you know, be contained within the community. I take you through, like I said, a behind the scenes tour of everything. And that way you'll know precisely what you are getting uh, you know, when you join. So definitely check that stuff out if you are interested and thinking about you know, wanting to join a community and let me know if you have any questions.